Hello and welcome to another Moog demo library. Today we're going to look at the WAV folder on Mavis. Mavis's WAV folder is a twist on the external audio input you might find on other Moog synthesizers. But instead of distorting when we turn up the gain, the WAV folding will instead fold the signal over. When we distort or overdrive an input signal, the bottoms and tops of that waveform get chopped off. On the wave folder, they don't get chopped off, but folded in on themselves. Growing as it did out of the external input, the wave folder is not, by default, patched into the signal flow of Mavis. You have to patch it yourself with a patch cable. If I press a key and play with the wave folder, you'll hear there's no effect because the wave folder isn't patched in. An external signal patched into the wave folder goes through the wave folder then to the VCF, and then to the VCA, bypassing the VCO. To patch the VCO in, I need to take a patch cable and connect the VCO output to the fold input. Now, when I press a key and play with the fold knob, you'll hear the range of tones created by the wave folder. Due to the way wave folding works, this will have a much more pronounced effect when using the saw wave as opposed to the square wave, where the wave folder has a much more subtle effect. Though we don't have voltage control over the fold knob, we can mimic it by using the LFO and mixing it with the VCO in Mavis's mixer. The wave folder will create different harmonics based on the way in which the input signal is hitting the ceiling or the floor of the wave folder. By mixing the LFO with the VCO, the LFO will shift the signal up and down, hitting the wave folder differently, creating different tones in time with the LFO. Let's move the VCO back to the saw wave and plug it into the two input of the mixer. Take the LFO and plug it into the one input of the mixer. And take the mixer one plus two output and plug it into the fold input. Now when I press a key, I can hear the wave folder as before. And I can start to bring the LFO in with the one level knob. We can also use the wave folder to process external signals such as from the Mother 32. Let's take apart this patch. and patch the Mother32 VCA output into the wave folder input. We'll turn the VCA mode of Mavis to on to keep the VCA constantly open. And now when we press play on the Mother32, we'll hear the Mother32 run through Mavis's wave folder and VCF. We can fold it. And also use the VCF to roll off and low pass filter Mother 32. Mavis's wave folder gives you a broad range of timbres not found previously on any Moog instruments, and you can use it both internally and in tandem with other external instruments.